welcome to Pitch and Cut Tests. We're going to be testing the durability and suitability of small kitchen equipment. During my travels, I came across an international rogue chef called Blade. We're going to ask him to test this equipment to its limits. Today, we're looking at battery operated kitchen scales. Blade, do your worst. Blade is going to be testing four scales for us today, each of them battery operated. The first scales we're going to look at is the Masterclass Salter Slimline, the Salter Disc, and the last one is the Brabantia. Blade's taking two identical weights of 200 grams. We look at the Masterclass first, showing 202 grams on a 200 gram weight. And then we're looking at the Soldier Slimline showing 205 grams on a 200 gram weight. He's now going to test the other two. We're going to look at the Brabantia showing 202 grams and the Soldier Disc is showing 204 grams. Blade's not happy with that. Next we're going to do a drop test on them to see which one survives. Masterclass seems to be working. Brabantia seems to be working. The soldered disc has stopped working. And the soldered slimline seems to be working accurately as well. And now for the water test. First one we're going to test is the soldered slimline. The next one is the Masterclass. I think Blade's enjoying this. The next one is the salted disc. There it is, dropping into the water. Now let's see which one survived the Blade water test. We've got the master class. There's plenty of water in that. No, that doesn't seem to have survived the test. We've got Brabant here. No, well that one hasn't also survived. And then we got the Salter Slimline. No, no readings on there at all. And lastly, the salted disc. Now, oh, she don't want to start either. Blade's got one more test he just wants to try out. Here he comes. Oh, nice buggy, Blade. One last chance, that's it. They've all gone. That's one hell of a test. They're all good scales. What you need to do is make sure you don't drop them on the floor. Definitely don't want to drop them in the water. And by all means, don't run over them in the golf boat. If you see Blade out there, don't look him in the eye. Don't speak to him. Whatever you do, don't mention a scarf. 